thanks, Breon. I can't tell you. I met Breon, I think we first met um, at the 478 Thanksgiving um, cookout that we had at the campaign office. Um, and from day one, Breon, you with your two daughters um, made an impression. When you talk about want a better life for your daughter, when you talk about want to build a community for your daughter, that's just the spirit we got to have. Your endorsement means so much because you are a, a, a single mother in the community that's going to need much support if we're going to have the community that we all want for our children. I commit to you that I will work tirelessly to support our young children and our families. We won't let you down. We will get this done. Thanks, Breon. It's such a blessing to be here. I'm so grateful for this opportunity. And I too, 100% support Clifford Whitby. Um, like Dynasty said, we met him last year. Mr. Sheldon invited us to um, a Feed the Homeless uh, feed making event uh, around November. And so I just, you know, I came by not knowing, you know, what exactly was going on. I just really to support things in my community like I always do. And Sheldon introduced us and like, you know, this is the man running for mayor making. I was like, well, I, I didn't even know about um, Mr. Whitby. So, you know, Sheldon introduced us and like Dennis said, we hosted an amazing brunch. And that was my first time really listening to the plans that Clifford Whitby has for making bill. Um, I'm an African American single mother. We already know the statistics. We already see the demographics, the unemployment rates, the teen pregnancy rates. We see the dropout graduation rates here in our town. And me as a mother of two young daughters, I I have to think about the future for my children. I have two children that, like me, were raised in making bill. I plan to raise my kids here and not move to Atlanta or not move to another city when I can flourish and I can be successful right here with the things Clifford has already done, um, I think at the industry industry and um, just around our community and the plans he has for the future. I support 100% because I see the vision. I see a man who stands behind his word. I just think about the quality of life I want for my family. I just think about how I was born and raised here in Macon, how I don't want to struggle. And I think about the leadership that our community needs for us to all get to the next step. And so I support Clifford Whitby 100%, and I hope you guys get to those polls and go put this man in the chair for mayor of making bills.